What's up beauties? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Sonya. And today you're tuned into a plus size spring Rev Dolls haul. Now, Rev Dolls dropped a fire, fire spring collection some weeks ago and it sold out so fast that like they couldn't even really get it out to influencers in time because everything sold out. And they dropped it twice and, and y'all bought it up like that and I don't blame you because it was fire. So today, I just wanted to show you a couple pieces that I was able to get. I have four pieces from their spring collection that I think are beautiful pieces that I wanted to share with you guys today. So if you're interested in this video, let's get right into it. All right, y'all, so obviously, I'm wearing one already. This is the first piece that I'm showing in today's video. I love it. It's so funny because I have not been a floral print girl for a long time. I never really liked floral print, but this year, people been coming out with a really nice print. Let me come up close so you can see it. So this is the actual print of the dress. Has blue flowers on it. And I just have it paired with this like fuchsia lip because it does have little bits of like reddish pinkish uh, spots in the middle of the flowers. And then I have it also paired with some green heels. So let me back up so you can see my shoes. So these are the green shoes that I am wearing with this outfit. I think it pairs super cute. I feel like this would be super cute with like a bag that matched one of the colors in the dress or even something that matched these shoes. So here is the entire outfit. Now, as you can see, this is another scrunch dress. <laughs> Y'all know I have a history of purchasing scrunch dresses. So I got this dress in a 4X. One thing I can say about this dress is this dress fits me well in a 4X. However, if you want it to fit tight, then just go a size down. I think you'll be fine in your regular size, but if you want it to fit a little tighter, then go a size down. And the reason why I say that is because this fabric, even though it's cotton, it's really light. It's like a t-shirt fabric almost. Let me come up so you can kind of see. Y'all see that? It's just like a light t-shirt fabric. So it's not really fitted naturally, which of course they have the scrunch going down and you can adjust this on your own. You can make it, you know, more scrunch or looser on your own. But let me turn around to the back so you can see. Here's the back. You guys can see it has that little like piece right here that flow. So if you just want that to fit tight like that, then I would go a size down. But other than that, your normal size should be good. Yeah, I just love it. It's so like fun and flirty, which is definitely my style. I love that you can adjust the string, make it tighter or longer if you want to. The sleeves though, the sleeves are where it's at for me, baby. You know, I've been loving an off the shoulder look. Very cute. A great alternative to spaghetti straps. It has the bell sleeve on it, which I like. And it's just like, very comfortable, it's like breezy. Like you could wear this all day. Like you could wear it to a cookout, you could wear it to brunch, you could wear it to dinner because it's that t-shirt material. So it's not really gonna be, you know, tight and uncomfortable, it's not thick. So even though it's getting warm outside, this is still breezy for it to be long sleeve. And I like it, accents the waist. I'm here for it, boo. We're getting spring brunch vibes we are giving very much outside we're giving very much meet me in the streets period so you guys let me know what you think about this first dress so this is our next outfit it is actually a two-piece set so a skirt and a top i have it on with some red heels these are the same heels as the green ones just in red so i have it on with this even though i have it on with red the color in the outfit is actually not red it's orange so let me come up close so you guys can see that it's actually orange y'all see the orange bra i got it up under here i don't have orange lipsticks or accessories so we just gonna play it out but yes this is the set it is that like very stretchy scrunch material that I really like. It has the spaghetti straps, okay? That's why we got all the hair to cover it up, okay? Got the straps here. You can also wear this as a tube top if you wanna tuck the straps in, it's capable of doing that. 
And then the skirt is that same stretchy material with the bottom. Now, I like this set, okay? It looks really cute on the model. I'll pop a picture here so you can see her. The only thing that I will say is I wish the skirt was either longer or shorter. And the only reason why I say that is because it's kind of difficult for you to tell this is a two-piece set with all of this fabric up here, like with all of this material that goes all the way up here. So I would kind of wish that it was like either a true mini skirt that went down to or below your knees or a mini skirt that was hiked up a little higher and cut like here. And the pictures that I took for Instagram, I did tuck this in. So I have some um, shorts on up under here and I tucked it in so it's a little shorter. So it's a little shorter like that. So you can at least see the skin, like a little peekaboo at the skin and tail, like this isn't an address, it's a two piece set. Um, but other than that, I like it. What do you guys think? I don't have a lot of purple in my wardrobe. I'm realizing that now. I need more purple in my wardrobe, lavenders and things like that. So I love this set with the combination of orange. I also don't have a lot of orange either. Let me turn around to the back. So this is the bag, don't mind my bra sticking out. This is the bag, it's just that material all the way around. So very um, form fitting. It definitely will hug your curves nicely and give you a little bit of shape. So what do you guys think about outfit number two? I think it's very spring and summer appropriate. The ruffles um, on it, very cute and flirty. I just wish they kind of made a decision about how long or short they want the skirt to be. Like, this skirt goes all the way up here on me. But you know, pull it down and it can flow right here. So I'm just like, what length do we want this skirt to be? And I kind of want it to be a little shorter if you ask me. That's just me. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Okay, so this next dress is definitely like one of my faves out of this whole haul. It is definitely in that fun and flirty category. So it is just this floral spring dress that has these little scrunches on the side so you can make it longer or shorter. It has this super cute little scrunch up here so you can scrunch this tighter or you know, loosen it up, whichever one you wanna do. Little tie right here, which is super cute. I love the color, okay? We got the orange, we got the red, we got the little mix of floral. It definitely accentuates my waist. I like, this dress is it for me, okay? I freaking love it, so I'm just gonna back up. I kept on the same accessories. I have on the same shoes with the earrings and the red, um, reddish orange lip. So these flow very well with these pieces. These are print, super cute. I like it, I like it a lot. It is spaghetti strap now. It is spaghetti strap. So there's definitely something that I would cover with my hair. And the only reason why I say that it's for me personally, spaghetti straps make my uh, shoulders look really broad and it just accentuates how, you know, big my arms are. It's not flattering on me, I don't believe. I know a lot of plus size women have that same complaint about it making your um, shoulders look broad. So I just prefer thicker straps or even like a two top or sweetheart, you know, off the shoulder type thing for me personally. But this, I like a lot. Let me turn around to the back. Here is the back, which this is the other issue with spaghetti straps. Even though these straps are adjustable, so you can lift them up or loosen them, but you know, they show your bra. So that's the other thing. Your bra is exposed. But here is the back. Just that same concept in the back. So this would be something that you would want to wear a strapless bra with if you have one. Um, I have my orange bra up under here, which is a cute little play, you know, off the dress, but it just doesn't look that flattering in the back. I could also put like a cardigan or something over this, but honey, when it's 90 some degrees outside. Okay. So yeah, this is spring dress number three. I am definitely feeling this. I think this is probably my fave out of the entire haul, just because it's definitely my style and something I can see myself wearing frequently. And our last and final piece is this solid maroon dress. So 
this isn't floral printed like all the other items but I do believe in keeping a very cute basic in your closet like a dress like this can we just appreciate <laughs> the waist the shape honey this is why I love body kind dresses like this because boo your shape be popping so let me come up close so you can see the color it is just a very true maroon color I have on a matching lip this little necklace chain and some earrings I love this look but the sleeve, <laughs> the sleeve is what did it for me. The sleeves, I was like, yep, I want this. The bell sleeve is definitely a favorite of mine. It just, it just makes everything look so much cuter. Like, it just makes everything look stylish. It just takes it to another little level. I like that. So let me show you my shoes that I put on. So y'all, I just did a very basic uh, leopard print slide-in mule. This is the type of dress where you can wear this with practically any shoe. So I just picked up a shoe that I haven't put on in a while and it's just this animal printed mule. But you can put this on with anything. Like, if you have a floral print shoe, it will be super cute with this. A clear heel, a tan heel, uh, a maroon heel, black, white, whatever you wanna put on, you can put on with this type of dress. This is why I love these type of dresses and pieces because they're basics which means that you can add anything that is more extravagant and printed to this outfit to kind of take it to the next level. So this is just what I chose to put on. And let me turn around to the back. You guys can see just a, you know, basic body kind dress. And that's that. I feel like I could do so many things with this dress. This is definitely a dress that can transition from warm months to colder months. When it gets cold outside, you can put some tights on up under here with some boots and go. So I love pieces like this because they're just essential in your wardrobe. You can do anything with this dress. So I am feeling it. Beauties, thank you so much for tuning into this quick haul. Shout out to everybody who was actually able to get some of those hot pick spring items that they dropped. I'm so jealous that I was not able to get all of them that I wanted, but I really love the ones that are featured in this video. So let me know in the comment box below, which one was your favorite? Which one you plan to purchase? Don't forget to use my discount code to save you some money. All the links to everything I feature in today's video will be in the description box below, as well as my body details so you can kind of gauge how it's gonna fit on you. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for 12K. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram at simplysonya underscore M, and I'll see y'all in the next haul. I'm gonna tell you a secret. The next haul we're doing is gonna be a 70s theme, so you don't wanna miss it, okay? See y'all in my next video. Love you, bye!